Om Shanti, today is your 91st day of your beautiful meditative Vardhan, a blessing where God the Father tries to tell us that if you are following me, if you know the secrets of what is going to happen in the future and you know about what has happened in the past, you will be totally, completely, not at all in any kind of stress or tension about the questions of life which many other people have because you know the future as what I have told you. You know the past, what you have done in your past. You know what you have to do in the present. So you know what is going to happen in the drama. You are satisfied with your own part also. You are satisfied with what God has told you also. You are not questioning it at all because you know what is the right path. And you know that everything which is happening in the drama is also accurate. So let's see what exactly does Baba have to say so as to make us feel that we are going to be victorious in this life also. Baba says in this blessing, may you have an intellect filled with the faith, faith what? That your victory and success is guaranteed. Victory and success not only in worldly things, not only in terms of being financially wealthy or in terms of having good relationships only, not just that. Success and victory in that you are purifying yourself completely as for guides, guidance of God the Father and you are trying to become more purer day by day and automatically your life whether financial, whether your health, whether your relationships, spirituality, physical, everything is becoming better on a daily basis. And you know that you are going to be victorious in that achievement. So then Baba says, may you have an intellect filled with the faith that your victory and success is guaranteed and thereby remain constantly carefree, not in stress and tension. The world is in stress and tension. Let's find out why. The children whose intellects constantly have 100% faith in the Father. Now many souls who don't even recognize the Father, they say, yes, I believe that God is there, but I don't know who God is, where he lives, what is his work, how does he look like, where does he come from, when does he come on earth, what is the right guidance, and everything when we don't know in these questions, the answers to them. That's the time we are completely not carefree but we are very very fearful because we don't know what is going to happen in the future. And that is what is happening in the future of all the people on this earth right now in the present situation. So Baba says, when you have recognized who you are as a soul and you have recognized the incorporeal God the Father, that's the time only when you know the truth and you are prepared for everything. So you have 100% faith in whatever God has said. And in Brahma Kumaris, we know that everything which we have learned for the past 85 years, all the scripts which we have read and what God had told us about that there are going to be some diseases which are going to come in the future, which are going to be such that doctors are going to raise their hands and we are seeing it right now. So we were prepared at Brahma Kumaris with all these things and all the souls in Brahma Kumaris are ready for what is going to happen in the future too, which has been revealed to us by Supreme God the Father, Satyam Shivam Sundaram himself. The God is truth, we say, and that's why his name has got the first title as Satyam in front of it. Because he speaks the truth to us. So then Baba says, 100% faith in Father, in their own parts, that whatever part I have got, I have got complete faith that this is going to lead me to complete salvation, complete liberation. And I am not comparing my part with anybody. So I am not jealous because a jealous soul cannot transition from Kalyug to Satyug. That means from Kali means hell to Satyug means heaven on earth, not somewhere else up in the sky. Heaven is not there. Heaven is not up there. We say that heaven is up there. We think that heaven is up there because it's a higher state of mind. So we think it must be something higher. No, it is the state of mind which is very higher and powerful. But the world was down here only on earth. Adam and Eve were here. So heaven was on earth itself. So the Baba says in their own parts, they have 100% faith. And in every act of the drama at every second, we can't question why is it happening, why this is happening, why government is not doing this, why government is not doing that, why my governor is not doing that, why my religious people are not doing this. We cannot question anybody around, not even around your home, not even your home members. You can't question why are they like this. Because you know the drama, you know the secrets, you know what is the condition of all the souls which has been revealed to us in Brahma Kumaris by all mighty God, Father, the one who gives a sermon of truth to us. So then, we act, we know every act of the drama at every second 
and have guaranteed victory and success because of this faith in father faith in our own parts and every act of the drama so we automatically have guaranteed victory and success we don't lose patience we have the power of tolerance and we have got every other virtue which needs to be there to feel victorious and to be successful because of having guaranteed victory we know whose hand we are holding that is god the father's hand obviously he doesn't have the physical hands but holding hand means following what he says what he guides us with is known as following him and holding his hand so because of having guaranteed victory they are constantly carefree so i don't have any stress because i know that i'm following whatever god is telling me and i'm going to be victorious and obviously there are experiences around it that's why there is faith around it so no signs of worry are visible on their faces you can't be stressful because you are stressful because you are doing bad karmas you don't know what is the right karma what is the right thing to do so you stress about your family members everybody but when we get to know the true knowledge and that every soul is brought their own karmas they're going to face it that's the time you're completely fearless you are prepared for everything you know what is going to come in the test paper they always have the faith that that task or thought is already accomplished so whatsoever baba is guiding us with whatsoever pure thought we have towards us towards our family members family members is not just the ones next of kin but everybody in the world is your family member so whatsoever good wishes or good thoughts you have for the world around you is going to come to pass and everything is going to happen and everything which you have thought about in purity and you have placed it in front of god the father and you have actually asked him whether it's the right karma to do or not and if it has been passed is going to come through and we have that faith and we know that when our mind our intellect and our hearts are pure it's going to happen for sure provided it has been placed in front of god the father and been accepted by him how do you do that we learn it at brahma kumaris then they never have any questions in any situation they cannot be like why is it not happening now they have the patience when will it happen they know the answers when the right time comes when everything in the world in the drama everything moves around and moves around in favor of it and they can see the signs they are waiting it they are not in a hurry because it's god's work it's not their own personal work so this is what we get to learn at brahma kumaris i hope you too can someday do the 7 days course and you get to know what is in depth what is the truth what is the secret of what god has revealed for us in the future because god is trikal darshi he knows the three aspects of time he's sitting up there he knows what's going to happen in the future he's knowledge full he knows what is happening now what needs to be done now and he knows what has happened in the past and what needs to be done for the future to be better and pure and a golden age so i leave you with this do come over some day whenever and learn this beautiful art of meditation to with the divine knowledge i leave you with this stay healthy stay at home om shanti Thank you.